hey guys today I'm here to show a quick demo of the web application that I coded for a government hospital at my city so I will be representing the quick features of this OPD automation system so let's log in So this is a, a simple front end for the user. The requirements of the client were quite picky because each and every input needs to be verified somehow. For example, if the age is less than 14, it should be a female or male child if it's above. 14 then it's male and female and there are also some uh, verification in the name if it contains same in the name it should change to male and if it's con if it contains core it should change to female there are a lot of big requirements which I had to code there are a lot of JavaScript if and else in the code but yeah let's see the quick demo how it actually works let's input one entry for example I will put my name yeah we have a name here age 24 male it automatically changed to male and let's see the category they have some category like paid or free and we select paid and there is son of and cheat sink residence uh, we can enter any uh, city i will enter the state here okay we need to select the department actually that there is a tab flow for each element but i'm um, just to show the list here i'm using the mouse but you can do everything from the keyboard from start to finish and let's save it okay there are live stats here we have a new paid patient here and the collection goes to 50 for one patient there is 10 rupees of charges yeah so after saving we need to refresh uh, as I said there's a tab flow for each element you can after going save you can go to refresh form and hit enter it will automatically goes to name field okay so we just enter a name and we can fetch the records of any patient which were previously entered and there are options to update the name and everything and you can even refund the money and it will be automatically deducted from the reports or the stats okay uh, you can do refund and then change the directory to any free one and then update and it will change to it will change the amount to the deducted amount okay and there's a they required some reports here the statical uh, statistics reports and some filtered reports like all the male all the female uh, let's see the statistical reports of today from uh, this date to this date and generate we have a csv format here okay we have uh, there are new patients here if there is some old patient it, it would be here and there are categories and total amount you can generate the reports from any date to some other date there yeah yeah here is for example filtered reports they needed male we need all the male patients from today okay, it, it, it would list all the male patients yeah these are the two male patients we have in the list 
okay these are the reports uh, then the, we have other settings uh, to take the backup and uh, everything if you uh, as you can see the primary key here is the registration number it starts with the year and then there are five digits here they the requirement for a year was around 60k patients so yeah I set it to five nines so for the new year they they wanted to change the registration number to 2016 and uh, five zeros so yeah they can do that manually of, uh, on the first day of the new year so the uh, it's a setting to fix the registration number in case there is some problem with the registration number generation they can fix it manually and you can take the local backup uh, here I took the local backup it would be saved here uh, today is 527 and we have the backup here and if we need to mail the backup we can also mail the backup of the database For example, let's let me show okay yeah it, it uses SMTP to mail the backup of the database to the specified email uh, it, it, it takes some times and uh, we are done database packed and email too let's check it here we have the backup of the database yeah it's in the SQL format obviously if we need to take the backup in the future so yeah this was the application uh, it it took me a lot of time because there were the I had I need to go there and ask for some other requirements uh, after each output they had something to change so yeah it took some time some days to finish it up finally it's here well thanks for watching I'm hoping that you would like the idea and the work thank you